Innovative research has the power to transform our future. The UNSW Three Minute Thesis gives us a great glimpse into what that future holds. 22 contestants from a variety of disciplines have just three minutes to pitch their research to a general audience. Competition is fierce, just as it is in the real world where you have to compete for research funding. My study is the first to unlock behavioural information using whiskers from Tasmanian devils. This means that those in command sanction the rape of women in order to terrorise the population and weaken the enemy's resistance. This is the Tolon Atoll in the Pacific. On this small island state, sea level has risen so much that the islanders are already evacuating and leaving their island. The curious mix of penguins and statistics can teach us so much about our cherished marine environment. It was really challenging to be forced to put everything into three minutes and that I think so far has been the most useful thing I've done um, this year in my PhD because it forces you to focus. There's prize money at stake along with the winner being sent to Brisbane to represent UNSW in the Trans-Tasman competition. The high profile panel of judges are marking the contestants on their communication and presentation skills. And this year we have some extra VIP judges. High school students from the UNSW Aspire program which helps students achieve their full potential through exposure to university life. At first, when I first got here, I thought it was going to be really boring because it was like 66 minutes of just listening to people and sitting down. But then at the end of it, I found that it was very in interesting and engaging and I learned a lot from people's thesis. I like, I like the first one. Well, my favourite is number seven. Oh, yeah. Three is one. Well, <laughs> Seventeen. One. 18? 5. Oh, 23. <laughs> yeah, I definitely feel much um, more inspired to come to university and to do a um, doctorate. Now that the hard task of judging is complete, the nervous wait begins. And the winner is... Sumaya Ahmed. The waiting game in the movie industry. Timing decisions for DVD release. I couldn't close my mouth for about 10 minutes <laughs> because I was just so shocked and, um, and it was just the greatest feeling I've ever experienced to be honest because I was competing with really, really competent and extremely brilliant um, contestants who had such interesting research from uh, curing lung cancer to reducing carbon footprint. I just wanted to say how proud I am of, of number one of winning, of being able to showcase my research and just getting people interested in statistics and it's just not all boring. And I was very excited, very happy that I won. I didn't expect it. Um, I think the question of gender is something that everybody is thinking about. I was very very happy about that, uh, especially coming from the Aspire group uh, and young people, young people engaging around these issues. It's a very sad uh, thesis and not a happy thing to be talking about, but I think this was a real opportunity to raise uh, an important issue and put it in a package that people generally tend to understand.